to just another day. So today you saw previously that we've been to Meadow Hall uh, to drown our sorrows after our um, Disney holiday was cancelled and obviously Meadow Hall you did a little bit of shopping. So today I'm just going to do a bit of a, a Primark haul. So first of all I got this baseball cap. So I've been looking for one for a while. Um, I've got quite a, a big head and lots of hair so I do find it difficult to find a baseball cap um, I did love this colour though nice blush pink um, and as you can see it's got like a, a gold Mickey head just on the front and on the back it also says uh, Mickey Mouse if you can see that there and it's got a like a, a tie no like a, a push through ratchet you know to make it smaller and bigger so uh, yeah that was that was one of the first things I bought and that was just five pounds it's okay looks a bit dodge um obviously it needs to talk about the t-shirt i'm actually currently wearing um i won't give you a full body shot because no one needs to see that but um this is a, a mini mouse t-shirt and it's got a little mini mouse written down the back which is really nice and i do like this like blush pink color i uh, don't normally suit this color but you know probably don't suit it now but i'm still wearing it and the next thing i bought was this wash bag it's a uh, Mickey Mini wash bag, again in the similar blush pink, bit of a theme going on here, obviously that's the theme they're going for at the moment with the black and white Mickey and Minnie and inside this pouch bit at the front is an extra black and white mini pouch. I think it's meant to be a toiletry bag, makeup bag, whatever you want to use it for. I think I possibly, most probably will use it to keep things like um, cables, pills things like that for when we go on holiday so it keeps everything all nice and and neat and in the in a line and um in a line so i haven't even taken it apart yet but i do really like it it's quite big i'll not use it as a makeup bag because um this just will not fit my makeup in it and this was six pounds again on the same theme and same design palette i should say is this backpack so I've got this backpack, um, I've had a previous one from Primark, brilliant, a lot smaller though. So I decided to pick this one up because obviously I get a lot more bits and bobs in it, especially with all the extra masks and sanitizer and things like that we're going to have to be using. So I've thought I need a bit bigger, big, bigger backpack. So it's got a, a, a pocket here at the front, I haven't even opened this so there could be all sorts in there. No, just a nice plain old pocket, <laughs> uh, big, like I say, bigger um, inside and uh, everything else I've got from there pretty much is um, clothing. But my favourite, favourite Disney has to be Cinderella. It was the first one I had on VHS when I was a kid. Watched it over and over again. So I have picked up this Cinderella t-shirt. Um, what I was really happy to see is being a larger lady, um, I could actually get something that fit me. Um, this is a 2XL, which is UK 22-24 amazing so i'm really happy with that so like i say it's like a, a cream it's not quite brilliant white but it's it's uh, just just off white for me and it's also got all this on the back as well that one was eight pounds next up a mini mouse t-shirt another mini mouse t-shirt because who doesn't love mini mouse again this one is like a brilliant white uh, but this is mini in her little tutu nice little sketch design and again it's got extra things on the back so it's just mini just little sketches of mini really showing off her tutu this one was seven pounds and finally for the t-shirts i believe yep yeah, is mickey so i think this is exactly a very similar design to the one i've got on uh, but obviously it's mickey and not mini and it's in like again it's in this like off-white creamy taupey color which i think is really really nice and this is what i was talking about with the uh the word down the back so this one says mickey mouse he was eight pounds so that was it for the t-shirts now these are not t-shirts per se they are actually night shirts but again when we're being so tall and a big person i think i could get away with these as t-shirts We'll see how brave I'm feeling when you get to the time. But this one, I absolutely adore Stitch. Um, yeah, so I've gone for this Stitch night shirt. So let's see if I can get him in shot. So it's just a big old Stitch face. 
and like I say, it is lo it is very long because uh, it is a nightshirt. Again, it's in the bigger size, which I'm adoring at the moment. This is eight pounds, and hopefully, yeah, uh, I think I think I could get away with that as a t-shirt, but we'll see. Um, little, little stitch tuck, cute. I had to pick this up because you know, who isn't a fan of Chippendale? And uh, it says there okay but snacks first in a nice shimmery gold and then there is chip and dale munching the way through um some acorns uh, with a nice like pudgy faces all stuffed up so again this is definitely a nightshare i don't think i'd get away with this one as a t-shirt um i just i think it has that nightshirt feel to it and, and look to it um again 2xl brilliant I never even noticed these in the shop, but oh, the cute little uh, Chippendale tag there. And again, this one was £8. So that's it for the clothing that I got in um, in Primark. But I did pick up one more thing, and it isn't technically Disney. So I just want to add that in there. But I had to, had to, had to have it. Born to Care, Care Bears. Now, I'm a child of the 80s, and it was either... A Care Bear or a My Little Pony fan. Possibly it could have been both, but in my house with my sister, she was My Little Ponies, I was Care Bears, and I just absolutely love Care Bears. Now, I used to actually have this guy um, painted on my bedroom wall. So, uh, yeah. So, I absolutely love it. This one, it, is, um, it isn't it is Disney, obviously, like I said. It's, it's a Care Bear. Slightly smaller fitting, but... I stretch it out and you know there's always as the saying goes i'll lose weight but i doubt i will but you know um, and again that one was eight pounds so this is the first time i've actually been able to buy clothing from primark in a long long time because i just don't think they cater for a, a larger audience um, which is a shame really because we've got money to spend too also from primark i uh, picked up these little disney earrings um, if you can see them there i've got little uh, mickey or mini heads, <laughs> little bows, and they are some little daisies with little diamantes in the middle. And um, bargain two pounds. And these are from a little while ago, but I just thought I'd let you, I'd, I'd, I'd show you these. Um, is I picked up these pins. Um, now they're not official Disney pins; they are Primark pins. But as you can see, I've got a little Mickey uh, hands making a heart, a little star, a little uh, Mickey head, a little uh, yup. <laughs> um, Mickey in a speech bubble and a little uh, love heart there. Again, I think I might be using these in a little craft project. Uh, but again, nothing to help stop you decorating your outfit or my new baseball cap with those. Uh, they were £3. And then I picked these ones up as well. Again, another set of pins. Uh, but they are Dumbo themed. So you've got the big Dumbo, uh, well, little Dumbo elephant, uh, the ball, star, a little uh, like admission ticket. Um, big top uh, tent there and a little um, what are they called carousel horse <laughs> that's what they are so I thought they were cute again three pound um, bargain Disney shop itself um, I actually picked up this and I absolutely adore it it is a little Marie travel cup it's not like a third well it's, no it's, i don't think it is thermos i'm not i don't think it is anyway so no it's just like a a pot mug but it has got this sealable lid on top so more for like having your brew in the morning not finishing it taking it with you in the car and it's uh, obviously got the lid on to help stop uh, spillage but it obviously got the little uh, drinky holes in there as well uh metal bottom keep it nice and warm but I just couldn't resist it. I absolutely love Marie. I think she is so cute and she's so sassy and uh, yeah, amazing. So absolutely love that. And that was 11, 11 pounds. A couple of weeks ago again, I picked up these official Disney pins and this is from The Little Mermaid. And I believe they are Flotsam and Jetsam. It says it right there, Flotsam and Jetsam. You know, the little snaky things that are do all Ursula's bidding so they should have been nine pounds but I got them off her for four pound fifty and then last but not least I picked up these um little mini um earrings little diamante if you can see like the mini headband the ears 
Um, so I picked those up and they were £10. They are sterling silver plated, so a bit, bit nicer in the year. And uh, I absolutely think this, I absolutely love them. I think they're cute, so that's why I bought those. The next thing I bought was this little Marie mug. I adore it. I got this actually from Shop Disney. Um, she's like a little squidgy tubby Marie. So it's just a little face. She's got little ears there. They're like on the, that's the front of the room and on the back is the ears. Um, and on the back it says, bonjour, little, little love bow there. And I just absolutely adore her. Now, I don't think I'll ever use it because A, the ears will get in my way. Um, I think it's just going to be a, like a, a bit box. So I'll just pop bits and bobs in there. Um, but I definitely think I shall be using this one a bit more. And this one were, online was £10. Uh, but I absolutely love her. So speaking of online, uh, I have been collecting the Castle Collection books. Now I adore these. I am a, a notebook collector, never actually writing half of them. I just like to have them, stroke them and um, yeah, just keep them. So the first one I've got in the, in the uh, collection is the, uh, again, perfect Cinderella Castle. Now I think these are absolutely beautiful. So it's got this little, um, what do you call that, sheath? <laughs> <laughs> little binding on it at the moment so I'll just take that off so you can see it's absolutely beautiful can you see the, the light fitting in that so as you can see it's like a glossy it's embossed it's like you know, so it's got like 3d relief um and I, I just I just adore it so like I say I won't I won't use them I'll just stroke them on the back it's got Disney Castle collection and if you've seen these online they it, it there's a whole sort whole series of things there's things like um a christmas ornament there are pins there's all sorts now i can't afford all that but again because i absolutely adore these i i, I do go for the for the book every time and this these are 19 pounds so they are a bit expensive for what they are but i just adore them so i will take some shots and show you properly what's going on there but um as you can see it's got the little castle in the corner on every page and then on every few pages let me just find that there is like a scene from the film and it's the original um disney cartoon so it's not the remakes i'm not a massive fan of the remakes i do prefer i prefer the original uh drawing you know animations so there's like a little scene there and then if you pull back these like um royal type uh, pages it makes a the the scene like more 3d over the over the actual uh, original drawing so i will like i say i will take some photos and show you properly each of those then the second release was arendale so i've only seen the first film so far um loved it brilliant but i'm not a huge follower of the frozen again not having any kids don't have to do what i want to do watch what i want to watch uh, but i will watch the second one eventually again uh, i've just taken off the uh cover i don't know what to call this wrap the wrap we'll call it the wrap uh, and you can see there is the castle from arendelle and again it's this absolutely gorgeous metallic shiny i love it i could talk about this all day every day um again on the back it's just got the castle collection this is the second one in the series um oh and it, it's all shiny and silvery on the edges cute again it has got the um the seat oh <laughs> get a poster with everyone as well again i'll show i'll show you that in more detail later but again you get the scenes with the acetate not acetate like a frosted paper i don't know what call it voile that's what I want to call it, over the top and it, it gives it a more 3D scene which you can't really see um, on the camera but I will take some better photos and uh, I forgot to say on the other one they get, they've get all got these little charms on the end of the book uh, bookmark and they're adorable so that's the second one in the collection. Now this last one we had to wait a long time because of the pandemic uh, they didn't release Mulan, uh, Mulan's the next one they didn't release Mulan so they held this one back so it was a 
long time waiting to see if this one was actually going to be released and when it was going to be released and would I miss it but I didn't my husband's awesome and he, he checks most days for me um so this one slightly different um exactly the same in that it's got this um now what we're going to call wrap on it uh, in the red and this is from Mulan so this is a palace in Mulan never seen it controversial I will have to catch up but adore it anyway I'm gonna get well fingers crossed I'm gonna get the whole collection but again absolutely beautiful this is like a red metallic this time the other two were on the blue side this is the red absolutely love it um again inside beautiful there's the poster on this one but again like i say I'll, i will show you properly this one's gold <laughs> gold on the outside so really really pretty uh let's try and find ooh, the bookmark so the bookmark to show you is like a little little sparkly hexagon absolutely darling saying the disney castle collection on there and again i'll just show you one of the scenes in there oops so as you can see it's like a dark original copy then you put the royal over the top and it adds another layer to it again this is like a full full scene again if you remove the royal you see it in the darker underneath absolutely love it so that's the three that i've collected so far what are we now uh we're in september obviously i should know this should be in the disney park but i'm not <laughs> um so hopefully get a new one in october and i'll uh, update you when we get that so last but not least whilst i was in uh, meadow hall they have this little shop called typo i don't know if you've got one near you or you've seen it before they do have a f um some little disney pins now i absolutely adore this one so this is disney enamel and it's just love with the little mickey mouse as the o uh it's in like that um 70s retro font i absolutely love that one and i also picked up this little green alien so he's adorable everyone loves the alien guys and it says go green save the planet this collection uh obviously these were a little bit more expensive these are 21 pounds these are official disney uh, but it's just like mickey and his pants uh disney uh sorry mickey with the word love little rainbow and then we've got uh, a little mickey head with a or a mini head maybe because it's got a little bow dangling from it so i absolutely love these um i think i'm going to be getting a bit of a uh, a pin collection going on here but so far these are the ones i've got absolutely love them so that primark haul turned into a bit of a everything haul just show you little bits and bobs that i've got um in the last couple of weeks or last couple of months with regards to the um to the books i so hope to see you again so thanks very much for watching see you next time stitch face stitch face <laughs> i can't think of the word stitch face